A group hoping to make packaged alcohol sales legal in Graves County is one step closer to seeing it become reality. Joe Jackson explains. Members of the group Vote Graves County Wet turned in a petition with more than 4,000 signatures to County Clerk Barry Kinnamore. Kinnamore says if he can verify 2,221 of the signatures, a special election will be held. If it has those, then I will carry it across the hall to County Judge Executive Jesse Perry, who has 60 to 90 days to set a date for an election. And if it happens, we will have an election within those 60 to 90 days. If it doesn't, They'll have to start again. Kinnamore says the special election will cost taxpayers between forty-five and fifty thousand dollars. They need to talk to their legislature and get that law changed. The county clerks have had a bill up there for several years to change it. Simply put the question on a November or, or May primary, and it doesn't cost any more money. Instead, we have to have separate election for these things, and it costs every time. Meanwhile, Shannon Bradley of Fancy Farm, a member of Oak Graves County Wet, says the drive to legalize packaged alcohol sales is about keeping money in Graves County. Right now, everybody's got to go across county lines to get it. You've got Leader Bottoms, Fulton, Murray, and now Benton. You know, and that's tax dollars that could be kept here. Bradley says response has been mostly positive, and he believes the measure will pass. I'm Joe Jackson.